So I'm at the Heidelberg main station and I'm going to take the 8.46 a.m. train IC2296 goes to Weinheim, Darmstadt, and then Frankfurt. And it should be at Frankfurt by 9.40 a.m. <laughs> Track 3. You see it in the middle of the board there. That's the train that we want to take. Up top there, it looks like a church. But then there's a sign that says the Dutch Parliament. So I'm not sure. There's a lot of those above ground trams. They go pretty fast. It's a good easy way to get around. I've already hopped on and off twice. Just when I see something. I can't even say we're taking the road less traveled because there's lots of tourists here. So much of this city was destroyed by World War II and it's amazing to think of how much they've rebuilt and how much they put into rebuilding it in the old way. They could have gone modern, which a lot of the city is modern, but they kept the old part old. This is what I, this is really what I came for, is this square right here, the square in the church. Here it is. The picture everyone has of Frankfurt. Wow. It is incredible. Gonna be lots of pictures had here. has got flowers he's planning to propose to somebody which would be really cool to catch that <laughs> yeah. i think we were seeing the other side of this building but i believe this is the rot house Yeah,
Um, that's incredible, and they got married. They do still perform weddings here, too. Lots to check out. I'm just taking it all in. I'm just a little overwhelmed. You have to look everywhere, up and down. So much to see. All right, let's go check out this church before we go to the other church. I think we were on the other side of that building, that ornate building we were looking at was the other side of this building. Church of St. Nicholas. This um, looks like 1405, maybe, is when the Rot House was originally built. And then um, 1846, I see. 1896, 1900. Those are dates I see on here, I'm not sure. And then above the figures, the date is, I believe, 1890, I'm not sure. 1892, I'm not sure what that number is supposed to be. Here I am in Frankfurt, Germany, and I'm here in the Main Square, the Old Town, beautifully reconstructed. A large square, you can imagine, it gets very busy here at times. It's busy, but it's not probably near as busy now as it has been at certain times. St. Nicholas Church behind me some fairly modern buildings compared to everything else. And the Rot House. And they've had two weddings since <laughs> I've been here. And it looks like a third is going in. Oh my gosh, bride and groom. They do still do marriages there. Statue of Lady Justice, right in the center of the square. And then these gorgeous half timber buildings. It's just picture postcard charming here. I think that does it. Leaving the square here, we're going to head toward the town. it right I can't miss it <clears throat> and someone come up and asked me where it was I thought I've not even been there yet but I know where it is it's 
get in there. Look at this gorgeous little square. So cute. Museums. Apothecary. A wedding reception back there. A brought workshop. Not getting anything, just checking it out. All of the traditional All of the traditional German meats And there's the green sauce Have to have some at some point Top picture shows an aerial view of Frankfurt's old town after the bombings in March of 1944. And as you see, the church is still um, standing. All the churches in the city, except for the cathedral, were destroyed. The cathedral did suffer damage, but was not destroyed. I was wanting to go to the river and I came out of the church and I turned and looked and I think we found the Mine River. It's spelled like Maine, but it's pronounced Mine. See the plane? Oh, I'm so glad to see the sun out. Oh yeah, this would be a nice shot. That's a pretty fat pigeon. See the cathedral in the background. It's kind of a cool looking. Look at that, how the glass looks like it's shrunk, it's shrunk into the building. This is Hup, which is the main garden pedestrian district, but the big mall, which you just saw, blend of ancient buildings and new construction. This Baroque guardhouse was built in 1730 and is now a cafe. It was previously a militia, prison, and police station.
the church is St. Catherine's Church, or St. Catherine's Church, next to the old guardhouse here in the Hopwich. I might try a little something. Oh wow, look at that building. Okay, so happy coincidence again. I was really captivated by this outdoor marketplace, but I also really had to go to the bathroom. So I saw Starbucks, and I knew even if I had to pay, I wanted to go to the bathroom. So I went in Starbucks, didn't see the sign for the water closet, but they did have stairs upstairs, so I thought, eh, it's going upstairs. So I went at the second level. Yes, it was a bathroom. Yes, it was free. So then I sat down, I thought, the one thing I really want to see that I haven't seen yet is the big stock exchange building. And I'm looking at my map, and then I look out the window, and it's right across the window from where I was stopped. The bull and the bear. This building was destroyed, but the statues that are out front were actually preserved. Pickling. Yeah. 
Eichnenheimer Tower. It's an ancient monument built in the early 14th century. It is now have a cafe that's used by the public and also historical societies meet here. It's kind of cool. the line to get into Louis Vuitton. I don't know. They must be having some kind of sale. I don't know. There's a line. There's also a line outside of Gucci. And there's a line outside of Chanel. I think I found the Rodeo Drive in Frankfurt. The Opera House in Frankfurt was built in 18... 80, one of the largest opera houses in Germany. It was destroyed in World War II, but it was rebuilt. Pegasus, House of Victory. She looks a lot like the statue on top of the Brandenburg Tor, except for those are dogs or dragons or I'm not sure what those are that's uh, in front of her. And then two famous composer flanking composers flanking either side of that second floor where there is a restaurant cafe and the square here is just beautiful this fountain is dry right now but nice park I was wondering I hadn't seen too much green space here but this is nice and then we have the modern side of the city. croissants with the, the chicken costs worse. 